Just about every modern, non-trivial software application makes use of data, making data access a significant feature of most applications. Over the years, Microsoft has risen to the challenge of facilitating data access with a variety of data access technologies and APIs, with acronyms like ODBC, DAO, RDO, ADO, and more recently, ADO.net. They built support for data access into languages and development tools, making it relatively painless to incorporate data into an application and bind it to user interface widgets. But most of these data access technologies suffered from either or both of two basic flaws. One was that they were just too close to the metal of the underlying data stores. The second was that they used generic data objects that were ideally suited to contain and work with two-dimensional data, but were often extremely difficult to incorporate logic and behaviors that useful business objects should have. A large part of the problem with the older data access technologies is that they did nothing to overcome the mismatch between relational database code and object behaviors in a true object-oriented application. This means that your data access code not only had to manage the flow of data between the application and data store, it also had to bridge the fundamental difference between the native database code and application code. Edio.net Entity Framework is Microsoft's technology to bridge this database application gap. Entity Framework is an Object Relational Mapper, or ORM, which manages the interface between application code and a data store. Using various models, it generates the code to create true business objects that integrate nicely into an object-oriented application while managing the flow of data to and from the data store. In this course, you'll learn some of the basics of object relational mapping systems and how they overcome some of the problems when working with relational data in an object-based application. You'll also see how entity objects are a big improvement over generic data objects, such as the data set and data tables provided by ADO.net. Then you'll learn specifically about Entity Framework, Microsoft's ORM technology, and why it's a compelling data access technology in the .NET development space. Big spoiler, it's not just because Microsoft has made Entity Framework their core data access strategy. You'll see Entity Framework in action to build a simple but powerful data access application, as well as learn about some of the APIs and tools that it provides.